another reason why I don't trust Alex Jones. It's his listed age. He uh, lists that he was born on February 11th, 1974 in Dallas, Texas. And if you look at his age, that would make him younger than myself. There is no way that I believe Alex Jones is younger than me. Um, he would be 39 years old on, in Febru on February 11th, coming up next month. He, he still wouldn't even be 40 years old. Do you believe Alex Jones isn't, isn't even 40 years old? Don't believe it, Alex. I think you're uh, well over 50 years old. You're, you're probably 50-something at this point. A man that will lie about his age, what's up with that? I put out uh, a video about my top five reasons why I don't trust Alex Jones. I want to I wanna get into that a little more because I think uh, this is the time for Alex Jones to come clean. Alex Jones and Kevin Booth and their, their uh, operation in Austin, Texas, I think it's time for them to come clean like uh, the WWE's Vince, Mc Vince McMahon did back uh, a couple decades ago when he finally admitted that uh, pro wrestling was actually wrestling entertainment. It, was, it wasn't real. It was uh, preordained results. It, it was uh, reality television that wasn't real. Professional wrestling, as we all know, is uh, not 100% real. It's scripted. And I think that uh, it's time for the Alex Jones operation to actually admit the same thing, that Alex Jones is not a real person, that Alex Jones is a, an actor, and that uh, what they do is uh, not 100% reality. It's based on reality. I think that uh, a lot of people would uh, be able to handle Alex Jones much more if they were honest about who and what he is. Looking at Alex Jones, and then looking, just take a look at Alex Jones' site. You know, I just popped it up today, and the first thing I saw were guns, pills, uh, you know, scare, scare, if you look at just the image of Alex Jones on his own page, it's, it's all about fear, it's, it's a scary look he has, uh, that's what Alex Jones has really been about, I think, uh, I almost wonder if Alex Jones wasn't actually secretly a liberal that hated conservatives and felt like uh, if, he, if he became an actor named Alex Jones, who was uh, the most far right conservative of all, that he could throw it in the face of conservatives that uh, he really believes that they, they, they don't uh, take action, that the, 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 the right wing of this country doesn't uh, have any balls, and that they're too afraid to confront the truth of the world, that uh, Alex Jones was his way to get back at the conservative right wing that never took him seriously. Um, a lot more I could get into, but I'm just going to kind of leave it at that. I think it, this is the time for InfoWars, Alex Jones, to come clean, to, to reveal whatever secrets he's truly hiding, because I think there are some secrets that are being hidden. And, and if you don't believe me, you know, I, I've provided some solid evidence. If you're voting down this video, I want to hear why you don't agree with me. Um, there's a lot more I could get into, but I, I just wanted to go to the stuff that was 100% verifiable. Um, his age, he lists 1974 as his birth date. I do not believe that. If there's anyone that believes that Alex Jones was, Jones was born in 1974, let me know. Because I, I haven't found a person that believes that yet, except for maybe Alex Jones. But again, I, I think it's, it's, it's kind of that turning point when InfoWars and Alex Jones need to come clean. The gig is up. If you look on YouTube, everyone knows Alex Jones is full of it. And it's time for them to be honest that their program is really entertainment conspiracy theory. It's entertainment television. It's not reality television. It's not real television. It's not um, truth. It's entertainment. Alex Jones is entertainment. And it's time for Alex Jones to be clear with people and to be honest with people that uh, his program is entertainment. And that's all his program is. Entertainment, entertainment, entertainment. Just like the WWE, World Wrestling Entertainment Wrestling is. It's not real. And it's time for Alex Jones to do what uh, Vince McMahon did a couple dec decades ago. And admit to the public to no longer car carry on the, f the charade that uh, what, what they're putting out to the public is 100% real. When obviously it is not.
It's time to it's time to own up, Alex Jones. It's time to be honest with the people, and it's time to uh, tell the truth about the programs that you're putting out into the world. Let's, let's think about if Alex Jones actually did what I what I suggested. Would that be the end of Alex Jones and Infowars? Hell no. I think that that would actually give them credibility for the first time for being so honest about who and what they are. Um, I I think that uh, it, it it is time. And if you look at uh, when Vince McMahon and the World Wrestling Entertainment admitted that they were not 100% real and that they were entertainment, they called themselves sports entertainment, uh, they, they basically admitted for the first time that their product was not 100% real, which most people already realized. What happened? Uh, World Wrestling Entertainment went through the roof. Their, their shows were more popular than ever after that moment. This could be even an, an even bigger moment for Alex Jones if he came out and told the truth. Let, let's, uh, you know, let's look look at some of the things in history that have happened. Uh, look at Tupac Shakur's murder. A lot, of, a lot of conspiracy theories about uh, Tupac being alive today. If Tupac ever came back and was actually alive today, that would like that would be one of the biggest news stories of the 21st century. That we're, that we're in now. Um, if Alex Jones came out and admitted that he wasn't really Alex Jones and that he was playing a role, he was playing an actor, and his whole setup was uh, a big joke, like Andy, an Andy Kaufman type joke, it wasn't quite 100% real, whatever the story is, the true story is behind the scenes, if they came out and admitted it, it would actually be the biggest media coup for that organization ever. Tell the truth. You want bigger ratings? You want to make more money, Alex Jones, and whoever else is behind you? Tell the truth.